Hello friends, uh, this is second part on how to draw contour lines in AutoCAD using SWDTM. So in this video I'm going to talk about some of the uh, common problems which you might face while drawing contours in AutoCAD using SWDTM. The first problem that you might uh, face is that suppose while entering your data you happen to make some mistake in the elevation, right? For example, you entered 1299 nine. you are supposed to enter 1299 nine, but you entered oh my god where is that okay so let's just use this point okay so you entered 12981 one. so you entered this uh, by mistake you know mistakes to happen all right so uh, by mistake you entered 12981 one as the elevation you increased it 10 times now you don't know about this error because it's all hidden inside 100 to 200 points uh, so you proceed normally you select all the points here like this and you click on points import points from excel import points good to go right your points are here you still don't know about your error and next thing you do is you just draw a boundary so enclose all your points inside a boundary however you like alright so then you triangulate yes click OK OK and after that you draw contour click draw So you see your control line. Oh my God! You be like, oh my God, what is this? So, oh, so there are a lot of contour lines here, right? So they have all merged in one place that you cannot see anything else. So don't worry uh, if uh, you see these kind of patches around here or here or anywhere. So just zoom in. All right. So keep zooming in, and you have to locate that faulty point. So for that, just keep zooming in. All right. keep zooming in and locate that point so as you can see uh, okay so this is our faulty point I hope you can see it so this is this is being highlighted here so this is our faulty point for that now select this point okay so we have selected the point hit delete now written back zoom out keep zooming out alright okay so after that uh, erase all the contours go to contour erase contour right then click on points again you have to process the points right so process the points click OK now go to triangles erase triangles again go to triangles triangulate so triangulation completed successfully now click on contour draw quick contour click on draw so now as you can see the problem has been resolved so if however you are able to locate that point for example uh, like if you are if you zoomed in and you saw that oh it's 180 number that is faulty if you are able to locate then you can go back to Excel and see 180 point here and you can correct it right it's just an example uh, so this is one type of problem which you might uh, face the uh, other kind of problem you might face is that your DTM might uh, just uh, uh, you know work very slow or work m uh, or might uh, you know uh, not respond at all at that time what you're supposed to do is that you need to uh, see all your data if they are correct or not uh, if the data is faulty then in that uh, situation the DTM might uh, not respond properly so that's it so those are the major uh, common type of problems which you might face uh, I hope this video helps you if you like it hit like and subscribe for more awesome videos thank you